I mean, I just thought it was you go back and forth during the story, and I thought that alone was interesting, but that's a thought. Did that say his story comes to an end? Ago, I'm yeah, so quiet, 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 quiet. Shut up. Shut your mouth. <laughs> but the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bush is empty. Oh, this looks fucking beautiful. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free of Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine, under branch, and into the forest deep. What is it with that creepy story? It's just a local tale. You're really into that stuff? Quit being so paranoid. Oh. No, no. Friendly. Friendly. Oh, Whoa. No. Who sent you? Holy oh. shit. They're coming. Who is? Oh. What are we working with here? I don't I want to know what this is. I don't know either, but I love it. I see people in the chat saying Outlast. I see people saying uh, Silent Outlast. Hill. Outlast. No. There ain't no fighting in Outlast. It's like Victorian era. Or vibes, at least. We're saying Resident Evil. Oh, Resident Evil, I think. No. No, it's not because uh, the the main protagonist. Yeah, see, it's something different. Uh, the main protagonist from. Wait, what? Dude. I Chris? Yep. There we go. Okay. Yep. Colin, where are you? We need you for this right now. That was okay, Why? what I just saw was not what I heard happened. But that what I heard happened might have also happened as well. Holy shit! Boom! <laughs> I the reason why I didn't think that was Resident Evil is because you didn't see the main protagonist from uh Resident Evil 7. And I and I knew that in Resident Evil 8 he was gonna be in it. Right. Um, and Chris Redfield as well. And uh, it was the first person perspective once you said that. I was like, oh uh, yeah, I think so. Uh, Man, I wish Colin was here to talk about Monster? fucking Resident Evil. Yeah, I mean I haven't been keeping up with the those games really so like i don't have a whole lot to say about it other than i was you know able to figure out that that's what it was uh, so yeah i did not expect that like it had that whole like coming I from i played resident evil 7 and that was like it. that was like uh you know all in the bayou in louisiana and then so yeah. coming from that and then going into like this go. victorian vibe you know what i mean um, also, was that I, supposed to be like Claire or Jill? Claire? I think that might have been like Claire. Or, uh, the, or the, when she was holding up the lantern, that face. Yeah, right that's, there. that that could, that's got to be Claire. That looks a lot like her. Uh, the likeness they used for Two, the remake right? of Two. Yeah. Colin, yeah. Colin would know, like instantaneously. I mean, they have Chris. Yeah. Um, Chris is a little different at the end, though. He was like. He, yeah, wait, go to, I want to see what, um, Chris looked like because it's they changed like the, right now because they changed how he looks. I mean, he yeah. looks older. He, he just looks, looks like better. grizzled and he looks different from how they portrayed him in, uh, seven, but they, I mean, he looks different in ev like every fucking yeah. Resident yeah. Evil and a little like more weight in his face. Like he's not, I as, mean, like... I think he's still brolic. <laughs> oh, he's definitely brolic. It looks like a retired like soldier gone merc now. Like that's yeah. the vibe I get from him. Mm -hmm. I'm so intrigued as to how the. I mean, shit. In in Resident Evil Seven, 
you you are at a loss as to how, where umbrella comes into play what the virus is all about or, um and so i feel like they they just like redid that in like did that in a whole new way in, with resident evil 8 cuz i mm-hmm. um, i can't imagine how umbrella comes into play here and you know it does yeah cuz oh, that's their obviously. thing yeah. i think we definitely need to see more from yeah. that Oh, <laughs> my